discuss dynamic symmetry with ideal features and proportions. The next topic is anthropometry, which is a vast and oceanic topic. We start with the physique classification, ectomorph, lean and long with difficulty building muscle, mesomorph, muscular, well built with high metabolism and responsive muscle cells, and endomorph, big, high body fat, often pear shape with a tendency to store body fat. We now start with the cephalic index. We have brachycephalic, broad, short, common among Mongolians and Andaman Islanders. Mesocephalic are nearly oval. Such skills are typical Europeans and Chinese. Dolicocephalic are typical Australian Aborigines and Native Africans. We learn in anthropometry, which is where anthropology comes from, that we study race not by skin color actually but by bone structure how else can they determine the race of a tribe or a civilization unless they dig up the bones they don't have any skin tissue samples that's why the Indians on subcontinent India are actually Caucasian yet they have very black skin the best book on this is Malvina Hoffman's um, Sculpture Inside and Out and Heads and Tails. Both books are tremendous. Heads and Tails, it, she's beautifully written. She travels around the world.